Hello? Hi, I was looking to speak with Dean. Uh, this is Dean. Hello, Dean. My name is Pastor Doug. I spoke with your fiance Julie, earlier this week. I hope you're having a blessed day. Oh, I am. Thank you. Yeah. She mentioned you. Well, hopefully she said good things. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, of course. Of course. Well, I feel honored to be a part of your ceremony. Uh, well, thank you. Like I said, she speaks very highly of you, so... You know, we're we're just very glad that you could do it and your schedule is available. Well, thank so. you, and the Lord thanks you for the compliment as well, because <laughs> I am nothing without him. Oh, so, yeah, sure. I, I agree, yeah. Okay, yeah. yeah. Well, anyway, before the wedding, I thought it would be good if we spent some time together to get to know each other a little bit. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. Wonderful. Yeah, sure. We could maybe hit the bars, pound a few Coors Lights, and read Bible verses to all the sinners there. What do you think? <laughs> Um, <laughs> I'm kidding, Dean. Oh, okay, okay yeah. yeah. Uh, you, you kind of threw me off. I bet I did, yeah. Pastor Doug doesn't party hard. Oh, okay. <laughs> At least not that you know of. <laughs> oh, right. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. Anyway, as your wedding pastor, I do need to ask a few personal questions before we proceed. I hope that's okay. Yeah, sure. Okay, wonderful. Well, first of all, have you ever been with a woman before? Um, well, yeah, uh, yeah. Perhaps I, I should re I perhaps I should rephrase. How well do you know your way around the female body? <laughs> Ex excuse me. Um, well, because you know, Dean, the female body is a wonderful thing, full of all sorts of hills and valleys and interesting surprises <laughs> around every corner. Is this something we should really be talking about? Um, I, well, yes. Uh, I mean, you're yeah, getting I, you're getting married, and this is one of the parts of marriage is being able to experience the female body. I, I know, but Julie and I have been together for a while, so I I, I think we're fine. You know, you yeah. shouldn't just take my word for it. I think what we should do is we should schedule some time when you can come over to my office and we can watch some videos together. <laughs> this is a joke, kind of like the bar thing you said earlier, right? Oh, you're, no. You're just kidding. No, I do this with every couple before the wedding. I think preparing for the wedding night is also one of the most important things you can do before a wedding. Uh, and I have a nice collection of softcore and a few hardcore favorites that we can watch as well. I, I'm sorry, but um, Dean, I, don't, Dean, I don't think that's a good idea. Dean, rem um, remember this. Even if you think you know where certain things are on a woman, there's nothing like watching the real thing in high def with your pastor. To okay. really, yes? you, you know, Pastor Doug, mm -hmm. i got to be honest. I don't really know if you should be officiating this wedding. I, oh, I think I need to talk to you me. about this later. And Why don't you come to my office? Like I said, we can watch some of these videos. We can even have some from the communion closet. It's no, really going to be a great learning no. experience, and God wants you to learn, Dean. No, Pastor Doug, you're, you're kind of creeping me out. I mean, this is getting a little weird now. Oh, okay. um, I'm, I really am going to have to talk to Julie about this, and, and I'm sorry, but I, I want to talk to her about probably going in a different, you know, a different direction. With, you know, speaking of going in a different direction, Pastor Doug's body also has a lot of nooks and crannies, no. and I do have enough no. sacramental wine that could loosen those nooks and crannies right up. You're not, okay, you're not understanding. Look, mm -hmm. things you're saying to me um, are not appropriate. I am not going to watch with my pastor. Oh, dear me. This is, this is not something that people do. And I'm just not going to be a part of this. Well, if it piques your interest a little bit more, there is some marijuana that I confiscated from some of the people in our youth group the other day. We could also partake a little of that. <laughs> no, no, look, you don't even sound like a pastor. Oh. Okay, you're, you're just a bad person. Well, all okay? of that is correct. I'm not a pastor, and I'm not the best person most times. <laughs> you're not a pastor? No. Then what are you? Oh, I host a radio show because this is a phone tap on you and your fiance Julie set you up. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you have got to be me. <laughs> no. Oh my god. <laughs> she said you were nervous about meeting with the pastor oh. for your wedding because you're not a religious dude and <laughs> she thought she'd scare you a little bit. <laughs> oh my god. I'm, I'm literally sweating. <laughs> oh. oh, well, I do have some towels that we could use to towel off okay. that sweat. Okay.